Hey, it's your boy 3CP, and we are back with some math And I want to show y'all this game because I put on my offensive and defensive clinic of this guy. This dude had every zero trio card, uh, most of them in the game. Um, you guys who just want to get the top teams and just have every single card, those used to be the worst players, the guys who spend the money, but then there's the guys who are decent and got the good cards that we can come through here. But the other thing I want to say is, in Ultimate Team, I think the thing that kills Ultimate Team is people who got theme teams and sp speed strategy card or getting plus two speed, plus three speed because you got a theme team. That's then y'all be going to hey, why does it go? Oh, we're tired of all these cards and nothing, nobody's playing the same. Or this guy's not fast enough. He's too uh, my 99 speed guys running with this 99 speed because we all run with the same that speed. You can get 97 speed at this point now in this game. So when like an actual random mouse comes out, the next random mouse was the probably the ultimate legend. He'll probably be what 98 speed. What's the difference? What's the use? Because the mouse you got now, if you got a theme team, you can get them the 97, 98 speed right now. So what's plus one speed? So like I said, theme teams are the ones that, I think theme teams destroy this Madden. It just having the ability to up your speed. We should be able to just don't touch speed. Let speed be whatever it is. That way, a Tyreek Hill or Randy Miles, any of those cars actually feel like unique. And be like, okay, this car, this, is, this guy's fast. We didn't do like back in the days when the thing was decent, that's what they did. They had the stats. You couldn't upgrade the speed, you couldn't upgrade all the stats. You just couldn't. Whatever the stats was, that's what they were. And that's what makes the cards feel unique. But y'all want y'all want every card to be Superman, Super Avengers, Thanos, every single one. Every time a card got y'all power them up, you want to put theme teams strats on them, strategy cards, you want everybody to be Superman everywhere. And that's what I say the, the that's why Ultimate Team is so bad because these niggas just that's how y'all think. But like really what am I I'm just a guy who beats people like you who spend thousands of dollars and I don't spend no money and I beat you. I'm just a guy who beats your little die squad all the time. That's all that's all I am. Well, don't look at me with God this has been playing Madden since what the first one that ever came out I don't know nothing <laughs> man let's get to this gameplay all right y'all so this is what we had this dude had this super team with Grunk and Fred Ronald Tyreek here you can see and I came out in the in the dollar three to the dollar pretty much <coughs> this game the whole game, I ran dollar with the same zone drop, so I've been using 25 flats, five curl flats. So let's see what happens here, you know. So this nigga, he got um Andrew Luck at quarterback too. So you already know. I think Andrew Luck is pretty good. He got he, he throws some dots right here. I started trying to man up a lot of people right here, and I was just kind of bad on my user there. My user was just not there. But I've seen what he wants to do. Looks like he's running the same type of he's running the same play that I run out of the Patriots playbook. Looks like he's running the Patriots playbook pretty much because I well, I don't think this play is out of the Patriots, but uh, <coughs> I know that FL's play is there. Right there, I don't know how he just he just barely got out of this shit. I was almost there for the sec but he just somehow escaped. But we ain't for the trip. We're gonna keep shoot our defense. I'm gonna send a pressure and almost just once again this nigga is just he's just barely getting out of these plays. Just, just so close to making a play, making a pick or something. So we're gonna skin it right here. I see what he wants to do. I'm gonna look, I'm gonna look, I see that little post, that little curl, and he's gonna take off with Andrew Luck here. Get a few yards, but we did keep him from 
for getting the first down, so that's still good shit. And like I noticed, like you always you have noticed the tendencies of your dudes you play. Once you figure out like the one play that you get like the right the pants are there, that's the 24 year old flat. That's the reason I put them at 25 there. I think if you put them at 30, that's they go just a little bit too far and he probably would have been on top. He would have kept people been underneath. So yeah. Ooh, he lifted me up. So I G Meyer has they called it the Dwight Hager, the White Hower tackle. And he says, lift them up and have sex with them too. <laughs> All the don't 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 tell me off y'all like y'all be saying that shit now. No, nah, but I'm not talking about having sex with no. Lift her up. As I say that, lift her up. <laughs> anyway, um, I ran this play right here for just having, he, he did not want to adjust to the shit. I was just destroying this dude with this play right here. This one play, pretty much. I ran a few different ones, but I was just having, well, I was having whatever I wanted with this play. All because I got that one hot route master right here, this corner route to uh, Uncle Vern. Tight end apprentice, get you a tight end apprentice because it's so important that you can put a corner right on the field. And if they don't defend it, you just keep taking it. But this play right here, specifically this play, because you can just that corner route gets so open. And right there, he tried to, he didn't you know he had to make a decision. He got to go to Deshaun Jackson or he wants to go get going. So right here again, we need him up. He got Derrick Henry. Like I said, he didn't have a great team, but. We are playing some great defense right now and some good offense. And I see what he wants to do. So I'll do it in double maybe and right there. I, I wish I could send that blitz every time like that, but I just have no idea how <laughs> that AEF came in that quick. If we could do that every time, y'all remember, tell me, let me know. Y'all remember the A gap from the old men before they had nano detection where you get. You would shift your line to the left or right, and that defense tackle would just come screaming in out of this same dollar. That was the reason the net on the text because of that. That right here, Remus with the play. And like I said, that's my five yard curl flats. And they make a decision that was Remus there. There's Remus, yeah. And I'm back. I'm back here. Get ready to score again. I see right here, he's taking it. I'll take the uh, right here. Deshaun Jackson is easy to sign. Deshaun Jackson was having a game tonight, this game. Um, so now we're 14-0. And right here he saw us running the ball. So this is what kind of got, got clued because he stopped running the ball. This, this drive was the only drive he ran in these formations right here. But he, he came out like, okay, if I can't pass it, I'm just going to run it. And of course, man, if I remember, if I come out that dollar, yeah, you should have to run the ball. But I was, I wanted him to count, wanted him to keep coming out in this because after I said that, I said, okay, he's running, I'm coming for the chicks, man. I made a bad decision and I did not deep half my uh, corner. Well, I deep half them. I mean, no, I didn't, but still, KL said, he threw that hour over top of the deal. I don't know how he, he ran right past running lot. Uh, and yes, yeah, running lot doesn't got that speed. But you know what? I was like, oh, watch that was wow. I don't even care that that was a fluke play. Hey, sometimes we need to get some fluke every now and then. Working for him just in the right place at the right time. And when I seen that, I was like, yep, there's nothing I can do wrong in this game. So right here, I seen this time he kept trying to, she was shading down, man. And we said, you know what, if you don't do that, we're going to make you good punch for it. So right here again, I said, okay, you won't do that. You think I'm running the same play, I'm going to hit you this time with a little cross of the arm burn, but he drops it. But I said, no, don't trip, because guess who we're going to go to? The MVP of the team right now, of the game. The boy Deshaun Jackson, you see that? I see the out route, I'm going to go here, and bam, the third touchdown for Deshaun Jackson. I think it's just having a game of his life right now. 93 overall to Sean Jackson. So right back in here. So after that, I guess he just like, you know what? He don't got time to to make any just you no know, running the ball. So he needs to fucking he said, fuck it, let me go back and start passing again. And go back 
back at it again and brought him out of the room, ran his ass out of the pocket right there and he couldn't do nothing about it. And it's, it's 21 to 6 now. And he like pretty much in the third quarter, he has to do something. He don't have to uh, pretty much stay. He can't stop me on offense either. So he's trying to get he, he got it on them back on like this bit. They were pretty good. He had a pretty good damn team level. But he can't stop me. And he already knows the pass my passing defense is because he's he can't get nothing going on the pass because we don't lock it out possession and a sack all the way, man. But he really can't get nothing going in the passing game because we are destroying the passing game. But he, he can't, like, he, he did not come back out in that run like he should have. Uh, even though he, I would have liked him. I would have I figured it out. And right here, I was just a split second late with my user. Just a split second late with my user, I would have picked that off. But I think he's gonna he's gonna keep it right back to me, I think. I think it's gonna be a point where he's gonna do it right back. I feel like I got him, but I feel like they're right here. Sitting the pressure. And that's just my line just getting not even racing, this is my line just playing great. Cause I guess he don't got no good offensive line back or something. Right here, once again, at time oh beautiful defense though by the that was Dawkins. Because I really never, usually the, the deep half uh, guys, they don't play that shit like that. But he actually played the hell out there, though, that rap. Because I thought it was going to be a touchdown. So once again, like I said, we've been dotting this guy up. He can't do nothing about it. Get him right here. That was a catch. Yes, it was a catch. And we are right back in time. Position of get another touchdown there from the road out here. A road out. Ooh, it gets dot. Bam. Throwing dots for dots for this guy. And who gets him? Of course it's got to be Deshaun Jackson. I said Deshaun Jackson has been killing him. And since we ain't ran the ball, let's give it a little bit. And bam, we just up here. He scores and this pretty much this nigga. He can't do nothing about it. And he's, we pretty much got our way with this guy. There's nothing this guy can do to stop us. We just having our way and ooh that shit in my pick I was right there I was right there I was like this split second it was it was it was a matter of time so it was a matter of time before that nigga throw that pick for me and you're always gonna tell you know when the party starts panicking and say you you wanna get a pick you, you know they tell us you you wanna get a pick and when you get that user pick it's over they're gonna quit and right here he's looking looking and we hit the fumble and this nigga, oh, we can't get it. Oh, wow. I'm saying my line, like, they're just having, they just getting pressure from the three-man rush. I'm three-man rushing sometimes four. He must have, like, some really bad line back. Because I'm, I'm, I'm still rocking 90 Michael Parsons and Lawrence Taylor. And, no, I took, I got that 90 Epinaza, whoever that guy is, from Buffalo Bills, right here. Look at that, nothing to go, nowhere to go, nowhere to go. He just chunks up the, this almost that he thought. We had this dude locked up in a box. And Pastor Sertain with another pick. And he says, nope, I am out of here. I can't take it. And that's what it is, man. We out of here, too. Peace.